all following hot temperatures for the weekend and a mix of some clouds, sunshine, and even a few couple thunderstorms. We're starting off our new work week pretty much calm. That's thanks to high pressure currently settling over parts of the Great Lakes as well as parts of the Mid-Atlantic. So really much of the U.S. we're just continuing to see this clear, dry, and warm weather. Anything in the way of storms is along the Texas and Oklahoma border. However, I am keeping my eye on another cold front that's likely to move on through the valley tonight and into tomorrow. So it could bring just a couple more light showers, but really like the past couple weeks. We should just continue to see plenty of sunshine, just a few more clouds today and tomorrow. But really the middle and the end of the week, we're pretty much just going to see sunshine. Building up that cloud cover just a little bit, especially by the time we get to Sunday. And Sunday really is going to be our only chance to see widespread rain showers that we really haven't seen for the past two or three weeks. So keeping things pretty much dry. The biggest difference from the past few weeks, though, is we're really going to notice our temperatures a little bit cooler. Still going to keep things warm, especially today and tomorrow, but look at Wednesday through Friday. Good chance we'll see temperatures actually dipping below our average of 76, but as we head into the weekend out ahead of our next system, likely we'll see our temperatures back into the 80s. So we're just going to get back into that trend where it's going to be warm during the late morning and afternoon, but our morning Overnight lows are going to dip down to the 50s and even likely in the 40s in some spots. So not a bad idea to be in that habit this week of having a sweatshirt or jacket as you step out the doors the next couple mornings. But by the time you get to the afternoon hours, really not going to need a whole lot. So as we start the morning, not noticing a whole lot across the Fort Henry Bridge. Just a calm breeze, pretty much clear skies and our temperatures now dipping down to the 50s. Even a couple spots are trying to dip down to the 40s. So like I said, not a bad idea to have that jacket as you step out the door this morning, but you likely won't need it by the time you get to the afternoon, as everyone likely will be in the upper 70s, like 78 here in Wheeling, with a warm spot of 80 down to St. Mary's and our cool spot of 76 in the Barnesville, as well as Woodsfield. So like the past couple of days, just continue to see sunshine. We start off the morning clear. Just a quick layer of clouds that will, will roll through late this morning, but by the time I get to lunchtime, so 1, 2 p.m., we're pretty much just going to be back to clear skies for the rest of our day until we get to tomorrow. We start off the morning with sunshine, but we see a layer of clouds that will start to push in ahead of the cold front. Even a couple showers that might try to pop during the afternoon. Not quite as heavy and stormy as what we had on Saturday across the valley, and anything we do see remains pretty spotty, with most of us mainly remaining dry throughout the day. And by the time we get back to sunset tomorrow, we're just going to be right on back to that sunshine. And that's how we're going to stay the rest of the week. Just going to notice those temperatures a little bit cooler, especially for the middle and the end of the week, but pretty much the sunshine through the end of the week. So come Saturday, back actually into the 80s with plenty of sunshine, but by the time we end the weekend, we'll try and see that next system rolling on through. So Sunday, really our best chance to see any widespread showers, though most of that will be during the afternoon and evening hours with mostly cloudy skies throughout the day and temperatures in the low 80s.